What's up guys? Welcome to another Scratch tutorial. Today we are going to be making this game where it's just basically a terrain generator. In Minecraft, as you can see, there is stone, there is dirt, and there is grass, and there's trees. So this is what we are going to be making today. So without further ado, let's get started. So first what we need to do is create a new project. So this uh, terrain generator is going to be made out of pen. So what we need to do is get the pen extension. So first, add, over here, there's this button over here called Add Extension. And we have a bunch of extensions over here. And what we will need to do is click the pen extension. So here's the pen extension. So what we need to do is call our project terrain generator so first let's create a new sprite and let's call it blocks actually we i have a sprite from my backpack over here and in this sprite we have all the blocks we have the grass block, the dirt block, the stone, and the tree block. So in our uh, blocks, we're going to call this blocks. So we know it's blocks. First, what we need to do is do a green flag. When the green flag is clicked, we are going to first, I'm going to show this. We are going to first. I'm gonna wait first. Let's switch our costume to stone first. When the green flag is clicked, we are going to erase everything. We are going to go to that position. We are going to make a block, and this block will create our terrain generator. We'll call this block Make Terrain. And then click OK. And we'll put our make terrain block over there. In make terrain, we're going to get a repeat loop and we will say repeat three times. We are going to switch costume to stone. So in our uh, real Minecraft world, we have like three blocks of stone and then two blocks of dirt and then some grass on top so repeat three times switch custom to stone we will stamp it and we will change our y position by whatever this block size it is mine is 15 by 15 so what you need to do is change this to 15. so as you can see there's our um blocks over there so duplicate this and next time and this time we're going to change it to two and over here we're changing this to dirt so as you can see there's our dirt next we want to s switch costume to grass we we'll want to stamp it and change y by 15 going to change y by 15. actually we want to put this over there well never mind just delete that because we don't need that so here is our block stack now we want to keep on repeating that until it covers the whole area so what we need to do is put a repeat loop around this i want to say 20 for testing so once it creates the grass you want it to go back to its O. Uh, first we want to change our x by 15 and then we want to set our y to minus 169 so get your set y and we'll say minus 169 so as you can see it's creating um the blocks 
Now, I feel like I need to do this a bit more, so let's say 29. So, it builds the terrain like this. And then I'm just going to make this 33. And you can do this if you want. If you want the terrain to generate like that, uh, once one block at a time, you can. But if you don't want it, you can right click the block and press edit. And over here, there's this button called run without screen refresh. So make sure to, it's a check mark and then click OK. So now it creates it very fast and you can't even see it happening. So it should look like that. And you see this block still there. So you want to show it over there. And since it's running without screen refresh, you can't see it shown and then it will hide. So you don't see the block over there. Okay. So now we want to make our um, blocks random. So get a pick random block. I'm going to repeat pick random one to two. So it should look like that. So there. And now what if we want trees? So we need to add an if statement. And we'll do an if pick random one, two, four is one, two, uh, 8 is equal to 8. We are going to switch costume. Switch costume to tree. And we will stamp. And we'll put this over here. And we need to put a change Y by 16. Or 15. Over there. So now we have trees in our terrain. Generator. And you can change this value. It's just basically how much you want it to be random. And for this tutorial, I'm just going to make a simple sky. And it's going to be a bright blue sky. So convert to bitmap and yeah. So there's our sky. And that's our terrain generator over here. So it's really easy to make. Uh, it's just... You, but first, what you need to do is, of course, add the pen extension. So that's all for today, and I'll see you guys in the next Scratch tutorial. Peace out.